All right, guys. Good morning, everybody. The most important day in the U.S. stock market history, I think, was today. Uh, the reason for that was because uh, I do believe that uh, uh, earning for NVIDIA was one of the very, very most important earnings that everybody was watching. Again, a lot of people think that this rally is not sustainable and uh, NVIDIA cannot sustain um, the growth that the people are expecting. And then what we saw here to the yesterday that actually it beat the expectation on the revenue by over 10%. That's crazy. Like uh, it already was $20 billion and then it re reported $22 billion. So what happened? Um, AMD and NVIDIA, both of them surged. It means that the AI mania is kind of real. Um, Jim Kramer said that uh, anyone who uh, shorts NVIDIA make sure that uh, they are invite me to their funeral. So this is a funeral of short sellers and the people who really think that uh, NVIDIA and AMD cannot sustain such huge uh, uh, um, a move. So what happened at the open, it was a little bit uh, traded below the WeWeb. I got long for the one minute opening range breakup. I got to stop that, but quickly it went back in long and added uh, <clears throat> as soon as I saw that it's holding above the WeWeb. Again, I had every reason to be bullish. On NVIDIA, popped up, surged toward these moving averages, the partial out all the way up to 777, came down, and I added more again for the break of high of the day. And the rest is history, as you see here. Yeah, so I added more, and then uh, I partialed out, and it's kind of flattened out. It seems that nobody else is buying it anymore. But uh, the better trade was on AMD, actually. Let me bring AMD here. So the better trade was AMD, very similar uh, to this, I went long. It was a little bit choppy at the open, but eventually did a really nice five minute opening range break up. I went long. I added more two times in the way from 172 all the way up to 183.77 that is being traded right now. So, and you know, again, I got uh, I partial a little bit out more. Uh, it did a really, really nice uh, 920 trade. So, uh, those of you who know this 920 trade, this is a really, really, really amazing 920 trade. This is a very important strategy, and I was actually looking at. Uh, AMD call options, you could actually take that trade uh, with buying a call option like at 185. Let's say, for example, the call option 185 for this Friday. Let me click on that. So at 10 uh, 50, so we're about it at 70 cents, we're up to two dollars and 20 cents. This is just crazy if you would have traded uh, AMD call options. This is something that I'm actually going to uh, show also in the money show that we have. So as you see, while trading was amazing, uh, the PNL is great. Uh, we are doing really solid on that. In the chat room, everybody had really, really good time. Um, people also shorted Amazon a little bit at the open uh, in this uh, in this drop from 173.40 to uh, 171. I think Thor traded that, but most of the people actually traded NVIDIA and AMD. So this was really nice. Uh, so I'm gonna go uh, for the presentation right now. Um, at a money show and uh, yeah we have also a really nice event uh, tonight TQQ is also running up again uh, all the indexes up IWM is still lagging is up only 0.7 percent but SPY is almost two percent Q is 25 percent of all-time high it's just it's just unbelievable I think this is an SMCI was also another uh, uh, chip maker chip designer that is up 26 percent over 200 dollars per share from 800 dollars to 935 dollars so this is just unbelievable uh, moves that we have. Rivian had a uh, really uh, bad earning and it dropped 26%, unfortunately. And uh, overall, I think, you know, I think this market volatility is amazing. And I think NVIDIA is probably going to go to 800 very time soon. I don't, I don't see this stock, uh, you know, anyone would short that. So it's really, really difficult to short this stock right now. AMD is also trading at all time high at 183. Now it's going to go to 184, actually. So we have this big ask at 184 probably showing up very soon for the break of 184. I still have 200 shares of AMD uh, sitting here. Um, and uh, yeah, that guys, this is great. So, uh, <clears throat> so remember, guys, uh, so what we are having uh, is a very good event uh, on Vancouver. The last few spots, if you want to join us, uh, I mean, it kind of is, is uh, event is sold out. But uh, in case of, you know, last minute cancellation, we, we want to have a few more people. Uh, joining us uh, and uh, yeah I'm super excited to see many people actually in uh, in the community so just go to bearabletraders.com and uh, yeah click on the summit event so April, April 7 and 8 we have a few days before and after a couple of uh, receptions as well but overall just crazy uh, crazy market 
And uh, thank you for everyone who came to uh, Vegas uh, for my presentation today and tomorrow. So I'm going to, after this, I'm going to head out to, uh, to do the presentation. Again, thank you so much, guys, and uh, all the best. Uh, so see you all in, uh, in uh, Vancouver.